Build the God Squad you've always wanted. InstantMuttCoins.com. Instant delivery, cheapest prices, 24-7 support. Use code CC, 15% off. EA tax 10% is covered. Hey, what is going on, Madden family? We're here talking about what to expect for the month of October, content-wise, and things coming into Madden Ultimate Team. This is not talking about the market and how prices are going to fluctuate. It's not talking about selling your teams. Uh, you know, that is all up to you guys completely. What I want to talk about is what we know is coming, what I think is coming, and other changes as well. So from a content perspective, we know we're getting a promo this Friday. The assumption is it's Mutt Heroes. Cool. I think those are going to go up to a 92. There may be like one or two 92 overall cards there. Would be really nice if there are. More realistically, expect 91 is the highest. That's kind of unfortunate. You would like to see a little higher, but 91, most likely 92 an outside chance that EA tries to surprise us. But you say, well, 92s, that's what these uh, Mutt 10 cards are. Exactly. They're going up this weekend. Legends are going to go up and overall this weekend. I, I, I'm counting on it. 92 overall set legends, 93 overall limited. Again, and that's going to flow into the Team of the Week cards going up by one overall. It may also affect the veterans, the flashbacks, and the heavyweights. I wouldn't be surprised if there's a weak difference there as well to build up more 89s in those packs um, before we had 90s. So maybe not next Monday expecting uh, flashbacks and heavyweights to go up to 90s. Maybe two weeks. Maybe two weeks. Maybe talking like the 13th or whatever it is would be my guess. Uh, additionally, your Mutt 10 solos and everything are going to be completed on october 25th be prepared for that if you have a card that you want to get nat and you already have one you can sell it you should probably try to get rid of it before the 25th just saying that's not really market talk that's just knowing what is going on uh, additionally football outsiders are going to be coming to the game historically they've come out on fridays um sometimes they came out on sundays who knows when it's actually going to drop but they are going to be coming out. I would expect it to be a pack in the training store. There's probably a max of a 91 overall in there with some low cards sprinkled in. Probably a more expensive pack than it should be. But we'll see. Hopefully they have good selections. Uh, and that would be nice. You know, we always want more content. I want usable content, right? Putting 84s and 85s in the game right now, it's, it's cute. I don't know anyone who really uses them. Um, some people use them for theme teams. And I get that. I'm a theme team guy as well. But... Uh, we want we want bigger cards, right? Not necessarily the highest overall card in the game, but you want big usable cards. You know, cards that can uh, you can add to your team, even if it's for a depth position. It's really hard to to run with an 84 overall card at this point, unless you're playing on the pack a day squad like I am. You, know, you got a little cheaper team on the side, so I would expect that. Additionally, uh, we had series two update about two weeks ago. Series three update probably is going to be coming soon. Uh, it sounds crazy to say. Uh, there are six more series updates coming. In. It looks to me like we're going to get up to series eight. Uh, we don't know the exact date. I'm going to predict November 1st. It makes a lot of sense, but it does fall outside of October. It doesn't really help this, but if it does come November 1st, we're not going to have this video ready to, to, to prepare you at that point or, or warn you. But just keep it in mind. Expect November 1st. Uh, for it to happen. I don't think the weekend the week before would be October 25th. That's when Mutt 10 ends. That's when we're going to be in the middle of most feared. We're going to be getting our free Mutt 10 card. There's no need to drop a series update that day. Wait a week. It's cool. It's fine. Day after Halloween. Awesome. Uh, what else? Uh, what else can we expect? I feel like that we pretty much covered a lot of it. You know, we have big promos coming in November and December. Be prepared for that. Most feared coming likely on October 17th. If they do a two-part drop, again, expect the 17th and the 25th or the 18th and the 20th, however they want to do it. Who knows? But expect that uh, for sure. What is it? I think it's the... I don't know. I think it's the 17th. Whatever it is. Uh, the That Friday. So expect that. It makes a lot of sense that it's going to come then. Uh, said if they do two parts, expect 94 overall masters as well. Would make sense. We also have house rules coming as well. Again, very soon. It's obviously not here this week. It'll be back next week. My expectation, a Nat Mutt Hero, random out of that pack. And then in two weeks, uh, when we get it again, 
maybe a Nat, uh, most feared-ish player, you know, and a most feared hero card, one of those 90 overall cards or 91 overall cards, like it's going to go into a set. Expect that for house rules rewards. You know, they said they're doing it every two weeks to give us a bit of rewards. Give me a mutt hero, give me a most feared card, bam, we'll call it a good day. That's a nice, that's a nice house rules. Don't make it too hard. Yeah, cool, 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 cool. Um, not expecting really updates to much else uh, throughout the month. Would love to see veterans replaced. It's not going to happen. We did used to have Mondays had uh, flashbacks, heavyweights, and veterans. This year it's spread out to three days. So in my eyes, we're missing two days of content. I would love to see that corrected. I just don't see it happening. I see that we're going to stay on this cadence until the off season, uh, or until December, sort of when they change it again. Uh, if they cancel veterans and flashbacks and heavyweights again, uh, I don't know who's going to be all that disappointed. This hasn't been a very good program. Replace it with something better. Campus Heroes. We put out a tweet asking a you know, petition to replace Campus Heroes uh, for veterans. I believe it got like 600 retweets and 1,200 likes. You know, they, they saw it. They saw it. But that's it. That's what to expect for October. We'll do it again for November. I appreciate you guys tuning in. You guys are awesome. I love you. And I'm out. Peace.